What are 10 Christmas gems around the Las Vegas Strip? Find out next on Jaycation. Hey, what's up, Jaycationers? Welcome back to another video here in the Las Vegas series. Happy holidays. It is Christmas time, 2021, and we're here at the Aria Casino checking out their holiday display. They have a beautiful snow globe behind me. We're gonna go check out 10 Christmas gems around the Las Vegas Strip in this video. So stay tuned, hope you enjoy. Please like, comment, subscribe, and let's check them all out. And here's number one, Aria Casino. So this display at the Crystals has like Van Gogh exhibit, Fendi boxes, Dior boxes, all the high-end shops with these beautiful white Christmas trees. Check out these little tornado art exhibits right here. We got them up top. We also got them down below. All right, Jacationer, so the next Christmas gem here in Las Vegas is the shops over here at the Aria. The crystals at Aria got beautiful poinsettias, white Christmas trees, this awesome stairwell here. So if you want to see some cool decorations, some high-end merch and all that good stuff, you can come over here to the crystals and just enjoy the scenery here. I just love the architecture around this mall. A little too pricey for me, but yeah, there's some great decorations over here. So let's go inside Aria and check out what they have over there and then move on to the next holiday gem on the Las Vegas Strip. Wow, so everything here at the Aria lobby is amazing. I love the light tones, pink, light yellow, powder blue, violet. Look at all that. They have some Christmas balls here. They even have a display where you can pose in front of a frosty Aria. And then they also have a gingerbread bubble over here this way. And the check-in counter is surrounded by two giant snowmen. And then I also got a nutcracker here. I just like the colors, nice and bright. Cool, so the Aria display has a few fun facts. Our exquisite snow globe has a base made from 200 sugar panels. The hot cocoa cup inside the snow globe is filled with tasty treats such as a large candy cane, colorful bears, and a happy snowman and other holiday confections. Check that out guys, they got donuts. Look at this globe. That is an awesome Christmas display right there. I am impressed, Aria. So the entire display required over 150 pounds of fondant and 600 pounds of sugar and 550 pounds of chocolate. I'm actually reading off the holiday display right in front of me. <laughs> so this is a definite winner. You gotta check out the snow globe at the lobby of the Aria. So I've actually almost reviewed all the budget hotels around Vegas and I'm about to go up to the, towards the higher end ones and Aria is a higher end hotel which I wanna review in 2022. So stay tuned for that. You wanna check out my hotel reviews? I have them linked down below. They have trees that look like apple trees but with red ornaments, pretty cool. And I actually just got approached by somebody asking if I wanted a pink bracelet. I don't know if it was free, but it probably wasn't. It was probably like, that's $20. Looks like there's even a Barbie cultural icon exhibition here for all you Barbie fanatics. All right, Jaycationers, next Christmas gem on the list is here at the Bellagio. You know, they change every season and now it's Christmas time. Beautiful Christmas tree centerpiece. They have a little cabin with a fireplace and ornaments here. They have a nice little clock tower mountain here too. A bunch of Christmas trees, it's beautiful. Let's take a look around it. It even starts at the front of Bellagio. They already have a few displays over there, which you're seeing here in the B-roll. And in the lobby, where you're checking in at registration, they have some really cool candelarias there. It looks like they got Santa's sleigh here with a bunch of presents. And look how beautiful yeah. this is with the bells and ornaments, doves, everything here, wow. All right, Jaycationers, if you're finding value in this video and you're enjoying the Christmas decorations around the Las Vegas Strip, please give it a thumbs up. It really helps out the video. And consider subscribing to Jaycation. I have a ton of Las Vegas travel and tip videos around town, so make sure you check it out. And now back to the video here in Las Vegas. This is also a great time of year to have brunch over at Sadell's to overlook the observatory. Gets you in that Christmas mood, definitely. So maybe we'll try it one of these days. This kind of reminds me of a landmark in Rome. Wow, you could totally spend a couple hours here just checking out all the intricacies of these displays. Nice little uh, clock over here with a polar bear. Check out this polar bear plunge with some penguins in the back. And you also got Doug's tree farm here with a bunch of ribbons, pretty cool. Oh wow, this is also a little ad for Coca-Cola. It's the classic Coca-Cola polar bears. 
Say that three times fast. Somebody was asking right behind me, is it poinsettia or poinsettia? Comment below, what is it? Check out the Neiman Marcus of Christmas decorations. A bunch of great things. Like they even have this really cool Santa. Super expensive things. And right next door is the world's largest chocolate fountain. Look at that. So every year, the Bellagio definitely comes through with these unique Christmas displays. Now, this is definitely my favorite place to go during the holidays, but let's move on to another Christmas gem on the Las Vegas Strip. Check this out. This is on the other side of the Bellagio where the shops are walking towards Caesars. Beautiful shining star. The next Christmas gem on the Las Vegas Strip is here at the Forum Shops at Caesars Palace. Now they kept it simple. I like their gold and just clear light theme here. Uh, they have wreaths decorated throughout the escalators, the winding escalators. It gives you a nice little traditional vibe here at the Forum Shops at Caesars Palace. Let's go check out what else they have here. A couple Christmas trees as well. Nothing as crazy as Aria was, but still pretty cool. So now that's what I'm talking about. That's what you call a giant Christmas tree. This is awesome. I really like this. And like I said, the simplicity of it makes it even the more classic feel like you're in Rome, but you're in Vegas. So awesome. Looks like good old water grill is nice and festive right now too. Got the nice Christmas theme with the Caesar's Palace emblem here. What's the name of this thing? A wreath? Is that a wreath? All right, educationers, so that was the forum shops here at Caesar's Palace. Now on to the next Christmas gem on the Las Vegas Strip. So the next Christmas gem here in 2021 in Las Vegas on the Las Vegas Strip is the Mirage. They have beautiful red and yellow poinsettias here. A couple of penguins with these white Christmas trees with red and silver balls. Really cool in this uh, middle atrium that they have here. This is always a classic area to check out when you're in Vegas. Penguin family right here. Another Christmas gem here on the Las Vegas Strip is here at Fashion Show Mall. They have a nice Christmas tree here where they do have fashion shows and they just have classic lights that are twinkling gold and white and the Nordstrom is decked out in Christmas stuff as well. If you are in the mood to go holiday shopping over here at Fashion Show Mall, parking's free. So come over this way, check out the decorations. Let's move on to the next spot. Next on Christmas gems around the Las Vegas Strip is the Palazzo slash Venetian where you go to the Love Waterfall and Love Lettering and they have a bunch of fountains right here and displays of red and gold Christmassy cheer. Look at this gold Christmas tree right here and they got trees with icicles decorated right here and more displays down the way. So another great place to check out your Christmas decorations is here at the Palazzo slash Venetian. Check out all these poinsettias with the classic long gondola display here. Then you got ornaments hanging up top with snowflakes. We're over here at the Mercato della Pescheria. Beautiful. Christmas tree right here, right here at St. Mark's Square, and they have a couple of other displays over here. The gondolas are decked out with balls of holly, poinsettias, and a wreath right there, so nice and festive. Pretty cool here at the Venetian. Next on the list for Christmas gems is here at the Wynn and Encore, and it's the Christmas displays over here. 
I'm looking at this Molucas Palace right here, Ice Palace, Christmas trees all over, and the beautiful balls that are hanging on the trees here with the lights. It's amazing. This is the most classy of all of them. I still love the Aria, but this, this feels like Christmas, like a classic, luxurious Christmas. We also got Christmas trees over here, all simply decorated. This is the Molucas, famed for the annual Ice Master Sculpture Carnival. This capital of legends lies on the edge of the great frozen sea. Got a cool Ferris wheel too right there. Walking through this beautiful area. They have other displays on each of the four corners. They have the carousel and then a few more palatial displays. Let's go check them out. They have one with a train set. Oh, let's go look at it. Blefuscu, a royal town home to many queens, but only one king, one jack, and a very busy ace. Cool train right there. Look at that. This one is Milden's. A uh, prosperous town with golden wish givers and friendly giddy goblins. This one is called Wagiwak, a kingdom high on a mountaintop where whirlies are powered by the warm breath of golden dragons in the valley below. Oh, so this is Khaleesi's castle right here. This is Dragonstone. This one is probably my favorite one. It reminds me of the Netherlands. This one is called Winnem. High above the neighboring towns floats the mythical village of Winnem, a mysterious and magical land crafted over many generations. This well-intentioned village is looked over by a great star which gives guidance to those who but only look upward. Then you got your hot air balloon with all the gifts here. I think this is usually here, but on the other three corners are the Christmas displays. The last one has a carriage and a carousel. This is Plips, a decidedly delicious village in the very heart of the field of dreams. If you build it, they will come. All right, Jacationers, we're getting through this list. This is probably my second favorite, but I love it. So let's move on to the next Christmas gem on the Las Vegas Strip in 2021. Hey guys, check this out. Tacos El Gordo actually has Christmas decorations up. What? So next up for Christmas gems on the Las Vegas Strip is in the northern part of the Strip in the newest hotel in Las Vegas, and that's Resorts World. They have this crystal display right here with Christmas trees and poinsettias and all that good stuff. So you're gonna wanna check out all the decorations that they have here at Resorts World. It's right next to the giant ball with Carrie Underwood right in front of me right now. I'm sure there's more, so let's go check out the bar over at Famous Food Street Eats that has Christmas themed decorations as well as drinks. Also, since I was last here in September at Resorts World, there are a couple more things that are starting to open up. I saw Mulberry Pizza, I saw Fred Siegel, there's a Raider Image kiosk and a few other kiosks around here. Nectar Bath Treats, which I see all over Las Vegas. A lot more things are starting to open up around the Resorts World mall area. It also looks like there's a Christmas tree in each lobby. I like this. The balls are a little more maroon and gold. And then the Conrad lobby had like more blue and white uh, decorations, so. Yeah, Christmas trees in each lobby here at Resorts World. Check out these red and green cactuses and horses. I don't know if that's Christmas theme for the NFR, the rodeo, but hey, it matches. We got some holiday cocktails. They're offering four holiday cocktails over here. It's beautifully decorated back here. Now you're gonna have to meow to get in here, so make sure you meow when you get in here. Now, I got the hot white. It has Bailey's hot milk, white chocolate with marshmallow, and peppermint chunks. Now, they pour some liquid in the inside. They give you this candy cane straw, and then you stick it in here from the, from the bottom. You got your panda. Shout out to Yellow Productions. I know he loves the panda. We're gonna try this out. Oh yeah. That is Bailey's Christmas marshmallow. This is heaven. Check that out. Oh, and you got your white chocolate ball up top with the peppermint right here. Mm. 
Wow, that is awesome. Now there's three other holiday cocktails that they have here. They have the Palm Springs Holiday, they have the Yuletide Punch, and they have the El Paso Nog. Now you guys know I'm a lover of Nog, but this hot white, it's like having chocolate milk with a little bit of alcohol. So you guys gotta make sure you come over to this speakeasy at Resorts World. Check out all the beautiful holiday decorations. Just enjoy yourself, have a nice holiday drink. Guys, they got Mike Jones number up on the chalkboard right here. 281-330-8004. We have our second drink. This is the Black Moon Rising. This is their signature drink here at the bar. Now this has Suntory, Taki whiskey, white port, lemon juice, blackberries, and egg white. Wow, what a mix. Look at this, the violetness in this. This is amazing. Oh yeah, it's got that sour blackberry taste to it. This is a pretty drink. Look at this. Cheers. Happy holidays, JK Shiners. So I was talking to the GM Chris over here, shout out to him, and he said that all the cocktails over here that are in their menu, they change seasonally. A couple of them stick around, the most popular ones do, but there's always a story and always an improvement to their drinks. So when you're coming over here, they're making you the best of the best and the most unique drinks with a story. So make sure you come here and ask the bartender what the drinks are about and what inspired it because look at this. This is amazing. Look at this. So unfortunately, when I interviewed one of the GMs of Famous Food Street Eats, Adil, I put my camera accidentally on slow-mo, so his whole interview was recorded in slow-mo, so I'm gonna have to talk this out to you. Adil was just talking about the Christmas stuff that's going on. There is a Santa Claus on select nights. They do play music on the DJ booth. And then in their dessert section, which I covered in my Famous Food Street Eats video, in that section they have Christmas-themed desserts. Now, he is modeling some peppermint dessert that he uh, showed me that's pretty good. And also an ornament based chocolate treat with sours on the inside, which he ended up giving to me. You're supposed to smash the ornament and then all the candy comes out and eat it. So I got that in my bag. I accidentally smashed it last night during my live stream. But special thanks to Adil. Special thanks to Lot Lot. Appreciate you guys for the love. Famous Food Street, this is awesome. And I definitely enjoyed the Vice Bar and their holiday themed decorations and cocktails. All right, so the next Christmas gem on the Las Vegas Strip is the Link Promenade. They have a Christmas tree in the middle of this awesome fountain that has multi-colored lights in the bottom glowing, a little water show. And they have different colors, light blue, pink, violet, uh, of ornaments on the tree, some gifts right next to it. And it's right next to the Las Vegas Strip In-N-Out Burger, the only In-N-Out Burger on the Strip. There's a bunch around Vegas, but this is the only one on the strip. This is awesome. They do have a light show of the Link High Roller Wheel and they play music every, I don't know, half hour, hour. So you might want to check that out. They played uh, Mariah Carey, All I Want For Christmas Is You and they had the lights synced up to it. That was pretty cool. All right, JK Shooters, so the last place on the list for the top 10 Christmas gems on the Las Vegas Strip is the ice skating rink here at the Cosmo. Now, you can rent fire pits, you can come in here, they're open 4 to 11 on the weekdays, and then 12 to 11 on the weekends, and then I think on the holidays they're 12 to 11 as well. So you can get drinks, food, everything over here. It's a good time, you can go ice skating on the Las Vegas Strip right off of Las Vegas Boulevard. looks like they have some uh, Christmas themed cocktails. They have the Griswold here. Shout out to the homie Jeff because I know he loves Christmas vacation. So the Griswold would probably be his drink from J&K Stay in Vegas. So they have a few nice drinks over here. So prices for the ice skating rink is $30 for general admission, $20 for locals Monday to Thursday and holidays also I think it's excluded. So you also can pay 13 bucks for a skate aid which is like a little dolphin or something, a seal or something that you can push your little kids around in. So that's uh, the prices, 30 bucks. You go skating, it was 35 over at Hotel Dell in San Diego, so not bad. And there was a cold front that came in last night and it's freaking cold here in Vegas, December 10, 2021. Now let's go downstairs and close out this video. All right, JK Shinner, so that will do it for the 10 Christmas gems on the Las Vegas Strip here in 2021. Now this is part of the JK Shinner Vlogmas series in 2021, so I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give that a like because it really helps distribute it throughout YouTube. And if you haven't subscribed to JK Shinner yet, I have plenty of Las Vegas food and travel content 
content, as well as San Diego, my hometown, and the rest of the world. If you want to support Jcation in 2021 slash 2022 going forward, check out my Patreon, PayPal, and my Teespring where I have a ton of Jcation hoodies, shirts, and other types of gear. So make sure you check that out. Happy holidays, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, whatever you may be celebrating this time of year. We'll see you guys in the next video. Stay tuned. And in the words of Jcation, stay traveling, Las Vegas. Happy holidays. Thank you.